Hi guys. All right, the, we're, I'm gonna try this backdrop out for now. However, the windows are over here. So I feel like it's maybe casting some shadows on my face, but we're gonna sit down right here today. I'm gonna show you guys a huge haul. Mike and I had a little shopping spree. Lost it a little bit. She's probably gonna post on her own channel, um, like the Sephora stuff, but I'm gonna show you what we got at Home Goods, Hobby Lobby, and TJ Maxx. And we did have some like um, things that we wanted to get from each store, but I don't think I got what I wanted to find. I really wanted to find some more plates, but I don't know what's going on with my home goods, but I'm just not seeing like dinnerware. I'm seeing all like the white stuff with the hobnail, but I'm not really seeing a big variety like I'm used to seeing. I don't know. I don't know if that's just because my town got like more populated since I left or like what, but there was just, I did not find anything. So let's start off with home goods first because we got mugs. Uh, I'm just going to tell you that straight away, but brace yourself for this Halloween mug with a little ghost kind of like flying over or into the house. I've, that's, this is the cutest thing I've ever seen. So I have my Halloween mugs right here and looks like I'm gonna have to put, put it on the other side, $4.99. Like that is just an absolute steal. Love the pop of orange on the pumpkin and then the white of the handle. Just, yeah. But Micah, Micah also got some mugs and they are absolutely adorable. So this one we saw it and i was just like no that this is her to a t right now i can't wait for you guys to see her like room tour i don't know when she's sharing it but you'll see this style really in there 4.99 for this mug as well there's really pretty like detail to it sorry about my nails they look absolutely awful i'm trying on your mugs my mugs are cute they're so cute wait for this one this one is just Look at that. So Look at that with the mushroom. They also had like, like um, a little, what do they call where you, where you can put the milk and you put the sugar? What's that little set called? But they had that. We didn't get it. $4.99. We just got the mug. That is just absolutely precious. Um, so those are the mugs that we got at Home Goods. Um, what, what else did we get? Oh, then we she got some um hangers i like that you picked the one with the gold because i get the same hangers but mine's with silver and it's just kind of like nice to maybe have a know which one's whose you get the gold mm -hmm. i get the silver so anyways she got a pack of these hangers 12.99 she recently got all new furniture from ikea and she put together like everything we did a whole vlog of it she got the Billy bookshelf, she got her makeup table, her desk, and she got a dresser. And she put all of that together. So I think she's finally- And my desk. Yeah, I said, and your desk. I did it all myself. Sure did. And, um, and I guess she's like, you know, now she's finally unpacking her clothes and stuff. That's the part that we're at. She said that we needed some clips, which I know we do. So $5.99. And I think she chose the perfect clips. I think these are super strong too. So, and I don't think they're kind of like break easily because that's what I've found is a lot of like the clips we get just tend to like lose their little snap. So, love these. Remember when Dollar Tree used to sell these? Um, okay, then what did you get this for? A little sponge because holder? You Oh, it's for the sink? And the, she leaves them either just floating in the sink or like on top gross. So I helped They're her. dry. No, gross. So I got her one of these little suction things to put on the side of the sink so she can put her little... You're welcome. You're welcome. Anyways, thank you so much for that. Um, Loki also got several things. I'll show you what Micah chose. She wanted to get him a Nerf ball. However, I still think it's too small for his mouth. He could possibly swallow this, but here we are, 4.99. dollars 
The problem I have with these two is that it's rubber and Loki likes to eat rubber. So we'll see how he does. The only time I want to play with the one is like when we're like at that park over there. Yeah. Like I don't want to do it in the backyard. Yeah. Um, then she got him a little ghost. We've just been like really spoiling Loki these last couple of weeks. Four ninety nine. He just had to have a little ghost. I just feel bad he can't come shopping with us. Because... Yeah. And then we got him a little vest. I think it's Eddie Bauer. He he has his first Eddie Bauer vest. A little puffer. Has a little fleece lined for his walks. I don't know how he's gonna do with it. I don't know if he's gonna like it. Loxy would wear hers. She would wear her scarf that I made her too. She was just such a good girl. Um, I feel like Loki will wear this too. So I have this funny story to tell her. I really don't know that it's that funny, but last night I was taking Loki for a walk and a bunch of little kids like rushed us and it was just me and Loki. And I really had never put Loki in a situation like that before. And um, so I, I really wasn't sure how he would do just cause he gets so excited. And he loves like being around people. The thing is that when kids are small and he's very excited, it's hard to know if he's gonna hurt them on accident. Like meaning he'll try to like jump or lick them. You know what I'm saying like that? But Loki did so good and they were everywhere. Like these little kids rushed and were touching him, hands on his back, hands on his face, hands on his side. And he was just so patient. He didn't, he did surprise me. He didn't react in the sense of like, he didn't lick them. He just, it was like he actually did know that they were small and he had to be gentle. And with Loxy, Loxy, I never had like a problem with her. She was just the most chill, sweet, biggest teddy bear. And so is Loki, but Loki just has a different energy to him. And, but y'all, he sat, he, and then he sat down. He just like sat and let them pet him. It was so freaking cute. Anyways, these little kids are like telling me their whole life story. Um, I don't know if their parents wanted me to know about that. I don't know where their parents were. Then they told me what they were going to be for Halloween. It was a whole thing. Um, so, yeah. Okay. So, that's it for home goods. The next place we stopped in at was Hobby Lobby. So, Micah, I'm telling you, every time I take you to Hobby Lobby, this happens. We get a puzzle okay. that we don't put together. Uh huh. It's beautiful. Look at it. Mm -hmm. Look at it. It has a bookshelf. I was sold. Okay. So it was $19.99, but it's Christmas, so it's 50% off. I think even $19.99 is ridiculous. I think $10 Mom, is it's pushing it. It's but it ended up being $10. So yeah. If I don't see you put this together, Christmas time, right there. Um, okay, then, wait, what is this? Oh, then I got a pillow. You know I could not help myself, so no one here is going to be the least bit surprised by this purchase from Hobby Lobby. And what was funny is I, we were going through the whole store and I was just like, I really don't need fall stuff. I really don't need Christmas stuff because I have hauled so much in the past, um, but we'll see. Um, it's fun to kind of like get new stuff every year, but I just couldn't walk away without this pillow. So $24.99, but Christmas is 50% off at Hobby Lobby. So yeah, and it's so soft. Like I love this plaid. So I had to get that, but let me show you the star of the show. First of all, let me show you what Micah got for her room. Apparently she likes gnomes and this is new to me. I love gnomes. And you guys know that I'm not a fan of gnomes just because I haul a lot of them just to show you guys what's new at Dollar Tree. They are very cute. They're just not my cup of tea. Let me see him again. And he's a gingerbread gnome though. So he was in the gingerbread section, by the way. And he's cooking. He's cooking. His nice. cakes, like look at him. He was $8.99, but 50% off of that. 
So he was $4.50. I feel like they bring a little magical touch. Yeah, it's fresh. However, keep, keep this in mind because we're going to show you some more stuff that she's going to do for her room for Christmas. You're gonna show you're gonna show your subscribers this, right? Yeah. Okay. But then I saw this mug, and when I tell you, grab your purse and go. I don't know why my hands look like this. This wasn't even in the Christmas section for me personally. They had it in the front of the store. I don't know if your Hobby Lobby did the same thing as mine, but mine redid everything, and now. I just, I don't, I'm not a fan of it. I feel like things are now like all over the store. However, whatever, not part of the story. This is a mug. This wasn't even in the mug section in the Christmas part at my store, but what, what did this cost? $14.99, but 50% off. And it is a gingerbread house mug with a little topper, with a little lid. It's obviously like strapped down, but I'm sorry, what? I can't, I cannot with gingerbread stuff. It gets me every freaking time. All right, so that's it from Hobby Lobby. Now I'm gonna show you guys our last stop, which was TJ Maxx. We got a lot of stuff from TJ Maxx. Um, so I'm gonna show you what Micah got because she actually did get quite a bit of clothing. So she picked out this corduroy jacket. It was actually in the men's section. It's really pretty. Kind of like layering it on top. Maybe a cute little top underneath and jeans. Um, $29.99. I wish there were like sales at like TJ Maxx. I mean, I get it. I get that the whole premise of the store is that this is already discounted, but I wish they kind of ran something like um, Hobby Lobby, you know? Then she got this quarter zip, which is very soft. It looks soft on screen, but it's actually softer than what you think it would be, actually. I wish you guys could reach through the screen, but just a nice little quarter zip, $14.99 with a hoodie. Love it, very, very cute. Just, you know, basics. And that's something that I think she's working on. Right, Micah? Where are yeah. you? Yeah, she's working on just kind of like... I got rid of like 80% of my clothes while I was in Florida because like mm -hmm. a bunch of stuff was just old or it just wasn't... Her style, yeah. My style anymore. So I got rid of a lot of stuff and now I need to just like kind of build slowly back up. Yeah. Right. And I feel like at her age, your style evolves um, a few times. And yeah, I just feel like, I feel like I'm probably at a point where my style will remain the same for a good amount of time if I were to ever drastically change it. But yeah, her style is just evolving. Um, she also got this, which looks black, but it's actually navy. It's just a nice knit. It actually does look navy on camera, but um, it's a nice knit that I think on her will be slightly oversized. It's Tommy Hilfiger. Wow, I love that. Um, I really love that brand and Ralph Lauren, $24.99. So really good quality. Um, and then she got this really cute little vest. She just kind of said like holiday, like this one surprised me with the cute little pearls. Isn't it just so darling? Yeah. It's so cute. So cute, little vest. And then I got this knit cardigan, which I'm so happy I found this because I feel like this is just the perfect color. I love this heather gray. I love how light the gray is. And then it's got pockets in the front. I got a large. They didn't have a medium, but I think the large is great too. So I got $29.99 for this. I could definitely see myself just like wearing leggings. You know, this will be a good transition right now into fall for me. So I'm very, very excited for but it's part of them. Um, all right. So that's some of the clothing. I know Micah also got shoes. Where are those? That's not this. Okay. Then she got some shoes that like really surprised me. Like you really did surprise me with this, but I guess in a way I'm not surprised because I do know like quite a bit of this is now back in style, but she got these like patent leather little Mary Janes. 
Like how cute with like a long on. maxi skirt and like a little tucked in sweater with like cute little socks, like cute little frilly oh, socks. Oh yes, I didn't know about the socks. So cute. Has like a beautiful quilt padding finish on the inside. So I thought those were cute. And then she got these. If this doesn't, if you don't think nine to five when you see these, I don't know. I don't know what. This is definitely, the the shape in this front is very much giving me late 80s, early 90s for sure. And I love that it's like making a comeback, but such a nice block heel. I like those type of shoes with jeans. Yeah, that's actually really cute. Um, makes me want to like get into it myself. $29.99. So those are also for Micah. Um, okay, then I got, um, we saw these for Micah's room. And oh my gosh, the mushrooms, they light up. Look how gorgeous that is. So, you know, she's gonna do little things. She's not gonna overdo it like I probably would, but um, she's gonna add little touches and she thought these would be really cute on her bookshelf. So there's that. So I thought that was really cute. I had to get this little um, checklist cause I thought Santa looked very vintage. At any time I see anything that has a vintage look, you know I'm going to scoop it up. This was $2.99. So I got that. Okay. Now let me show you that I did get a mug. <laughs> I don't even know what to say. But it's Max. And the reason why we got Max is because we have the Grinch. So we thought it'd be cute to kind of have uh, $7.99. I like that it has his name, like collar. Yeah. So, super cute. Love that. And then we also, she got candles for her room. She got this one. I wish you guys could smell through the screen because this smells divine. Evergreen like shimmer. I haven't either. This is so unique. But, I mean, like, you get evergreen for sure, and that's not unique. But... The shimmer. There's something else in here. There's another note in here, and it just makes it so lovely. Um, it has a really beautiful snowflake design. This was $9.99. I love that. And then she also got this small little candle. She's going to save that one for Christmas, but this one she's going to burn now. This cute little vanilla bean. It smells so good. This one was $5.99. So she got some... Here we have the room. All right, but brace yourselves because the last couple of things are pillows. So first of all, I got this snowflake pillow. They also have this in a green option at TJ Maxx. I want it red because my, our stockings are red, our tree skirt's red. So I wanted to pull more of that, $24.99. So it's probably gonna be the lumbar pillow for right here. And then I'm gonna do my plaid like you've seen me do. But these pillows right here had everyone talking and I'm so glad I got them. I hope you find them if it's something you want. Yeah, Micah basically told me to get to go back and get them. No, no, I, I, they had two, I got two. And honestly, I'm glad all they had was two because if they had four, I probably would have gotten it. And that I think honestly would have been too much. But gingerbread house pillows, not to mention the colors on them are perfect for me. They did the brown, the white, and the red. And that's really like what I'm trying to pull out more in my kitchen. If you don't know, I decorate with gingerbread in my kitchen. I've had a lot of decorating videos. I'll link my Christmas playlist down below. And so I do a plaid traditional theme in my living room. I do kind of the same in my bedroom, really the same throughout the house, but my kitchen gets a gingerbread theme. And I saw these pillows and I said, I, I cannot walk away without these. And so what I'm imagining is that those chairs, I'm just going to place it on two of them. I think that's a perfect amount, or they could actually maybe end up in my dining room, but I think they'll end up there. Um, but yeah, I'm just going to put one on on two chairs and like leave it at that. So I just had to get them. They were $24.99 as well. 
So the most fabulous pillows I've ever bought. And then Micah needed a hamper for her clothes. So we got this one, I think it was $24.99. And that was our big shopping day. This feels like a secret score. I don't know why, I think it's just because of the way my Hobby Lobby had them. They weren't with all the Christmas stuff. So I was so excited. They were, it was pretty stocked. To be honest, maybe it's because people didn't look there like I, you know, I don't know. I just saw them by, by chance. But anyways, I'm so obsessed with this mug. And, um, but that's it. That's today's haul. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you like this video, these style of videos, please give this video a thumbs up. Definitely helps out my channel and it tells me what you guys like. And hopefully really soon, maybe even tomorrow, it just kind of depends. We might be decorating my living room for fall. So stay tuned for that and I'll see you guys there. Bye.